Um, hey guys, I hope you're well. Um, it's been a little while, so it's good to be back. Okay, cool. So um, I'm going to be looking at creating functions using Python. Okay, so what I'm going to start doing is I'm going to import uh, a module that I'm going to use. So from math, import, and then math directs there. Okay, so I'll define a function, then I'll solve a problem using it. Okay, so dev and then division a b okay and then my answer equals to uh, a divided by b then return um, answer cool so right so so I'll type in uh, division Um, just think of a random number, um, 2,344 divided by a uh, random number, uh, 66. Okay, so there we are. I mean, I know you can, you can always do this. But um, just it's, this is just to show you how to create create functions using uh, Python. Okay, cool. So then um, my other one would be like so. Let them product. A B. And then um, answer will be equal to A times B. Okay, and then return answer. Okay, so so my product twenty three times fifty seven. So there we are. Then another one as well. So div and then expo. So that's a exponential exponentiate. Okay, I can say I can write result. I don't have to write answer. So result to be um, then uh, return result. Okay, so expo uh, thirteen to the power six. Okay, you can also type that as well. So power. Okay, cool, right? And then in modular uh, modular arithmetic, so def, and then uh, I would say uh, modular uh, a b. Right, and then my uh, I'm just going to say ants equals um, then a percentage b. Then return. Um, ants. Okay, so then I'll type in modulo. Right, so if I say uh, 20 uh, divided by 4, the, um, my, my modulo is going to be 0 because there's no remainder. But then if I type in modulo, uh, say 10 and uh, 3, so 1, this remainder 1. Okay, right, and then I can also do like um, and a function, you know, like a polynomial. Okay, so I'll go to this. So def, then f of x, right? And um, I want to solve the polynomial. Um, say x, x squared uh, minus two x plus one. Okay, then return. Ones, right? And then if I type in f of x, if I put one, so I get zero. Then f, and then if I let's say put uh, x is three, this is what I'll get. That's so and so forth. Okay, cool. Then um, simple arithmetic so add, um, addition. So def, then add, then ab, 
then uh, the result equals a plus plus b then return the result okay so yeah um, so add 2307 and seven oh sorry an eight or seven anyway yeah uh, plus uh, five four four so there we are okay and then same for subt uh, subtraction so divide it then subtract then uh, my result will be um, because um, a minus b then uh, return return result so subtract um, so yeah 100 minus um, 57 Here we are. Okay, cool. And then, if I want to calculate a percentage, let's say for instance, um, say ten percent of a uh, thousand, something like that, I could also do it this way. So dev, and then uh, percent, and then a b. Okay, and then uh, my answer will be right. So bracket a. Uh, divided by 100 times B okay and then return answer right so so percent so 10 uh, so 10 percent of a um, thousand there you go okay and then um, I can also do a boolean one, but um, let me just do it so define, then is same. So a b, right, and then um, ants equals a equal to b, right. Then uh, return ants, right. So um, so it's same. So I mean it's pretty obvious. Ten is ten is ten, right? Yeah, it's gonna be true, right? Yeah. So it's same. It's just to show you that you can you can just create you can create functions and stuff. Some of them are just like pretty pretty done obvious. Okay. So ten uh, fifty. It's gonna be false, right? Yeah. So it's just a boolean function, right? Then I'm gonna do a quadratic one. So dev. Then uh, quadratic. Uh, so A, B, and C, right? And then uh, X. My value of X will be uh, so so minus B, right? Uh, plus. Then the square root. That's the reason. The square root part. That's the reason why to import that uh, module there. Because then it becomes defined, right? So I'm square root, and uh, that's uh, b squared, and then minus uh, four times a times c. Okay, and then just want to make sure that I've done it right. Uh, just build me one sec. Right, yeah, so another bracket there. And then um, divided by uh, 2a, 2 times a. Okay. And then uh, uh, return x. Okay, cool. So if I've got a polynomial, say um, I'll just type in quadratic. So my value is 2. Uh, one and minus one. Right, so that's one of the roots. Okay, then I'll, I'll do the same as well, just using the negative sign, um, negative minus square root. So c command copy. 
All right, and then I'll put a negative there. Okay, and then um, so quadratic as well. So two, one, and minus one. So I've got one. So those are the two roots of the quadratic equation. Okay, cool. So it was just um, a vid showing you how to create uh, functions, like basic functions and stuff, that sort of thing. So yeah, hopefully that's uh, helpful for you guys. And uh, if you like what you see, uh, please subscribe and I would greatly appreciate that. So have a good evening. Cheers. Thank you. And goodbye. So goodbye.